So this is a quick video of my setup. Basically this video explains the brand of my that I'm using in my home theater. Um, top part is an RC64, third gen uh, generation uh, reference series. Um, on the sides is the RF82's reference series. <clears throat> on the top are my high speaker and I have four of them and those are the RP 160s and I have four of those in the hot for heights and two for surrounds on the bottom part there I have the pearl diamond perdon 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 uh, subwoofers sorry um, and those are 14 inch subwoofers and I have two of those uh, eventually they will be replaced with SVS Ultra 16s and I'll be running probably I'll be running three of those uh, and there's my Ultra 16 uh, PB and that is piano gloss and that is basically my flagship subwoofer right now in this room then on the middle here is the stand is a salamander and on the bottom two that you see there is the the tall one is a seven channel evativa amp and the shorter one there is a five channel evativa amp and those run all my speakers that i have and bottom between there is a paramax um surge protector and that's basically to protect everything the whole system on top of there is a moran 7703 <clears throat> the side there is a cable box and on the other side is the oppo 203 for my blu-rays and 4k movies on um, top of there i have three android boxes well at least two because one's an apple so basically i have a roku android box and an apple tv that's what's there on top of that is a 75 inch sony z series uh tv their 2016 model and that's basically where their flagship at that time and that's the tv that i have there um that completes everything from here top part there is my voice of god and that's a 58 see uh in ceiling speaker and i have three of those one voice of god and the other two is a the rear for um surround back surround sound besides that those are the couches one couch there and the main couch sitting area is right here and that curtain there is basically eventually going to be gone and there's going to be a door there um that'll look nicer back there right now i have that to cover up all the boxes back there um and as you can see this is not an actual uh theater room it's not a dedicated theater room it's a living room space and i just customly designed it with a uh, home theater installers and got the best sound that I could get from this area and also has carpet that um, was customly designed just for this area here that I wanted to match with the uh, wall paint that we went with back there all my blu-ray movies <clears throat> and that completes my um my home theater i will send more videos out um when i get updates um probably the next video i'll lit literally explain the difference between atmos and oil 3d just as soon as i listen to a lot more i want to listen and I, I have a couple of friends that are probably going to stop by sometime this week and i want to see their opinion when they come here and to figure out how to explain to you guys what's major difference as soon as I get more of an audience coming over here and they can give me more detail because right now in a little 
I don't want to say too much. The only thing I can say is that uh, Atmos and Aura 3D is different. Um, they both are great. And that's pretty much where I want to leave it right now. And DTSX also is great. Um, and like I said, I want to leave it like that right now till I play a lot more with it. Um, and I also want to um, watch a lot more movies and stuff like that um, to see. As of now, it seems like Netflix is my favorite to watch with all 3D. Most of the movies on Netflix, I've been watching it with all 3D. Even the series like Punisher, I've been watching that with all 3D and I love it. That That is a very um, great sound with them um, as, as of now. Um, but like I said, I want to play a little bit more and watch more movies and then I'll get back and let and explain to you a major difference between them all and try to explain to you how it is due to the fact there's not that many people out there that do have all 3d setups that i can see and like i said i'll make an update video